that's good. Hey, we were talking about William Shatner before. Yes. There's that show, Stars on Mars, starts oh. today, 5th oh. of June. <laughs> <laughs> what was the point of this one again? Were they simulating something? Yeah, it's set in Cooper Pedy in Australia, South Australia. Right. Most Marsy place on earth. Very Marsy. Uh, apparently Mad Max uh, Beyond Thunderdome was was uh, also filmed there. Filmed there. Well, Mad Maxes, they were all filmed in Australia, right? Yes. All the Mad Max films yes, were filmed yes, in Australia. Yes, yes, yes. But yeah. yeah. Yeah, apparently, yeah, it looks like the surface of Mars. Okay, so and what's the point? What, what is it again? Just to survive. I don't really know. I don't know. It's like Big Brother but in a Mars environment. So surely we know who the people are now. Apparently. Weren't they celebrities? They are celebs. You got one bowl Armstrong, Lance Armstrong of cycling fame. He's doing stars on Mars. Apparently. Okay. Bruce Willis's daughter, Tallulah. <laughs> Rhonda Rousey. Ooh, no way. Yep. No way. That's exciting. That's How do they get do. all these people? Oh, I don't know. And they even got, do you know a guy, oh, what's his name? Marshall and Lynch. Do you Marshall know Marshall and Lynch. Sounds like two blokes. No, Marshall and Lynch is this beast. He he played for the NFL. He's a running back for the Seattle Seahawks right. when they were good. He was like the the tip of the arrow for them. Whenever they needed like to win, they just give the ball to him. He had this thing. I don't know if he was sponsored by Skittles or what, but he'd eat Skittles and just kind of get superpowers, a bit like Popeye, right? With spinach. So he was always seen on the sidelines eating Skittles. I don't know if he had a sponsorship. Surely. Wow. Other people on the list. Christopher Mintz Plas. I didn't know who that was. Had to click on his name. It's um it's 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 McLovin from Superbad. You're so kidding me. McLovin, McLovin from Superbad's on this Stars from Mars show. Rhonda Rousey and Bruce Willis's daughter. Mate, we are spoiled. I know, right? So there's all these celebs. They get together. So there's 12 of them. It's hosted by William Shatner, who's 92, by the way. Whoa. But he is synonymous with space. Is he? Yeah. Well, he's been to space, I guess. He's, he's physically been to space and he played the spaceman. Why is Ronda Rousey doing this show? Because she's a pro wrestler. Yeah, but... She gets paid doing pro wrestling better than she's going to get paid doing this shit. Who knows what they get paid? They must be getting paid a bit because, I mean, you got one ball Armstrong there. You know, like he's got better things to do than you know, this, go on this big brother type show. Who, so Lance does? Yeah, Lance. Well, he's still competing, is he? He's not no, competing. No, 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 but yeah, he doesn't need to do something like this. <sighs> He must really cash. think it's a good a idea. Cash. Yeah, a bit of cash. So they say it's a social – this is uh, William Shatner has got some quotes on it. Yeah. Of course he's going to be plugging it and talking it up. But it's a show – It's a show. the show is a social experiment unlike anything else on television. Yes. It is the most realistic Celebrity Mars Colony simulation ever created. Well, I mean it's the only one, isn't it? Say that again. It's the most realistic Celebrity Mars colony simulation ever created. Great. <laughs> Huge bar. So apparently they're living 24-7 in a hyper-realistic Mars habitat. The goal is to survive. Right. Test their leadership skills. Right. Will they thrive? New. No. Only one will make it to the end. And? That's it. That's what do you one, mean? one will make it to the end and but win or whatever. Win what? I don't know. Like the, <laughs> the kudos, the kudos. So oh. Shatner said the celebrity contestants required intelligence, which is very rare at this time. I don't know what that means. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that mean? But there was a psychological element right. that has become a major part of the show. Okay. Shatner says the psychological element became something palpable. 
He also said that there were human emotions that you would have never expected. I bet you I will. Yeah, you know, I'm going to call it. I'm going to say Marshall and Lynch will get together with Ronda Rousey. Like they're both quite um, rowdy, sort of aggressive people. They might be, like being roughed up a little bit. I reckon they could, you know, they might see each other as a bit of a challenge. Mm. And McLovin might, who knows what he'll do, he might. Oh, man, McLovin. He might challenge Lance Armstrong to a sack race or something. <laughs> yeah, he might flip, you know, might try and flip Ronda Rousey. Maybe. Shatner said well, there help. was selflessness and concern and team spirit. I mean, it was remarkable. There was a humanity that I would never have thought of. It was beautiful. <laughs> so that starts today. It might be on right now. <laughs> What's it being screened on though? It's a Fox show, right? Stars on Mars, Ronda Rousey. That's blowing my mind, dude. That is, is blowing show, my yeah. mind. Other things Ronda Rousey's been up to lately? Yeah. Um, what? She played Sonya Blade in the video game Mortal Kombat 11, which I did not know. I, I had a quick look. I don't know where this Stars on Mars thing is going to stream. How are we going to get this? Because it sounds dreadful. I think I need to see it. So, and we should be what we should be supporting the Australian film industry. Yes, and it is filmed in South Australia. So big ups to SA. Watch Stars on Mars in Australia on Fox TV. On Fox TV, okay. I think I've got that. How All right. Watch... Yeah. Okay, you need a VPN. To. I think the winner should have to go to Mars because they've winner? proven oh, right. that, that it, they, they have what it, it takes. To I cannot with... believe the names that are in this thing, man. How yeah, big McLovin names. Get in? Big names. New Australians just noticed. <laughs> yeah, unless one of them is Australian and I'm just not familiar with them. You know what's on the cover? It says, from the red carpet to the red planet, stars on Mars, June 5th, Fox, next day on Hulu. That's what it says on the ad, right? And it's a, it's a, it's a helmet on the Martian surface with some sunglasses with a bottle of champagne and a lipstick. And written in lipstick on the helmet is, my agent is so fired. So the premise is they don't want to do this, but they're they're all doing it. How do they how do they, how do they get someone like Ronda Rousey to be on a show where on the front it says "Get me out of here"? You know what I mean? This, hmm. this sucks. Hmm. Anyway, I'm a big Ronda Rousey fan. I was there when she kicked that um, when she got kicked in the head by Holly Holm. We were there. Witnessed some history. Made the trip across to Melbourne. Yeah. 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 Saw some history. Um, and good luck to her on the stars from Mars. But my tip, and I think you should put a tip in as well for the winner. Yeah, I, my tip, I'm going with Lance Armstrong. I think he's got the. Yeah. He's, <clears throat> I think he's got all the right stuff. Hopefully, who's Portia Williams, Real Housewives of Atlanta star? There you go. I'll go with her. Yep. Excellent. Sounds so we've got our tips in. We'll see. She sounds we'll like a real wins. saucy pork chop. Yep, my go getter. Portia Williams. She doesn't look familiar, but I don't think I've ever watched Real Housewives of Atlanta. No, you haven't. But I reckon she's going to make a name for herself. All right. Being Off, a star okay. on Mars. Filmography. Okay, so she's done Real Housewives of Atlanta seasons, a lot of seasons of that. Uh, she's done. New Celebrity Apprentice. Yeah. She's done Sharknado 5, Global Swarming. Huge. She did The Apprentice in 2017. She's done a lot of things. She's done. She's got things I've never heard of. Oh, and 2023, the latest thing before Stars on Mars, The Real Housewives Ultimate Girls Trip. 
Okay. What a wild life she's lived. Okay, I want to, because I didn't know who she was. I'm going to, she's out. She's out for me. Right. And I am back. I just got to go with Mr. Skittles, man. Marshawn. Okay, okay. Okay, yeah. so you've, we're, we're bad. I reckon, up. yeah, he'll be a formidable opponent. Excellent. So we've got our tips in. Yeah. For stars on Mars. Um, don't know how to watch it yet. But we will. 